everybody! Welcome to Sing with Susie. Happy Tuesday. Cinnamon Bear and I are so ready to see you today. Let's see who's here with us. Go ahead and say hello. Hi friends. Let's see who's here today. Type in your name so we know who's here. <laughs> Welcome everyone. Welcome to Sing with Susie. This is our 14th week of our stay at home concerts together. We're so happy to stay connected with you. Let's see who's watching today. Hi Pedro. Hi Joe. Nice to see you. How's everybody doing today? are so ready to dance with you today and sing. <laughs> Happy Tuesday, Rita. It's great to see you. Thank you for staying connected with us. Let's see who's here. Hi, Trisha. Hi, Sophia, Simon, and Sam. <laughs> Rita says, hi, Cinnamon Bear. <laughs> hi, Jared. Hi, Jayla. Joe's requesting his favorite song. <laughs> Welcome, friends. It's great to be with you today. We have a super exciting week lined up for you. We have some amazing special guests coming in tomorrow and Thursday and Friday. Hi, Eliza. And we have a super fun show lined up. We're teaming up with Park Slope Parents for a Park Slope Parents Summer Friday show. And then we have a dance party coming up on Saturday. Yeah. <laughs> Who feels like dancing? <laughs> That's it. Put your hands in the air. kicking off our 14th week and we're so excited to be here with you today. We have an amazing lineup this week. Just want to give you a quick overview of what's happening. Tomorrow we have my very special guest Elena Moonpark joining us and she plays a variety of instruments and will be sharing some songs from East Asia with us. Then we have on Thursday Julia and Louie the dog. And then on Friday, we have my dear friend Olivia singing with us as part of Summer Friday. And Summer Friday, we're teaming up with Park Slope Parents and we're doing a fundraiser for Little Essentials. And there's gonna be puppets from Puppetsburg joining us along with Olivia. That's so exciting. And then on Saturday, we're having our very first dance party! We're having a summer dance party in our backyard to celebrate the first day of summer. 
and this is a ticketed event. Saturday is a ticketed event, so you just have to go to my website for all that information, and you can get your tickets there. Hi, friends. We have some more friends joining. Aw, Alex is back. Yay. Lucy is here. Hi, Lucy. And hi, Jenny. And Jill wants a copy of the CD. You can get all of that right on my website, suzyshelton.com. All right, let's get started, friends. We're going to start with the dancing song today. And this song is called Wings of a Bird. And there's many different animals in this song. So if you feel like standing up on your feet and flapping your wings like Cinnamon Bear, you can fly like a bird. There's also swimming like a fish. So we'll see if you're ready to do some swimming and some more animals in here too. Here we go. Spread your wings. That's it, Cinnamon. That's it, friends at home. This song is written by Nelson Gill. Here we go. If I had the wings of a little bird, talking a little bit that this is a super super special week and we have special guests joining us tomorrow Elena Moon Park and Thursday we have Julia and Louie the dog and on Friday we have my dear friend Olivia singing with us as part of our summer Fridays that we're teaming up with Parksville Parents and it's a fundraiser to help out a wonderful organization called Little Essentials and we're having puppets Puppetsburg will be here, and this event is sponsored and presented by the Segura Lewis team at Halstead Real Estate. Yay! That's happening on Friday. Then, on Saturday, our first ever dance party at our house. 
And this is a ticketed event. It's at 5 p.m. And you can go ahead and find all of that information at suzyshelton.com. And Joe, you can also find information on where to purchase my CDs right here on my website. All right, let's see. Oh, we have some more friends. Wonderful, wonderful. Hi, Mia and Alex. Hi, Emily. Hi, Bailey. Oh, you're requesting Ice Cream Man again. <laughs> that was a fun one. Maybe we'll be able to do that one today. I know that takes a lot of energy out of Cinnamon Bear. What I wanted to do today, um, I am teaching some friends in the mornings for my little music and more class, which is so much fun. And some of my friends watching today are part of that class. And we've been talking this week about gardening. And we've been having our classes back in my beautiful garden that my husband has worked on all spring. And it's just gorgeous. And there are many things in the garden like bugs and flowers and rocks. And we have some kindness rocks that were introduced to us by my friend Mr. T last week. And this one says, you rock. And this one says, let your light shine. And some of you have been painting your own kindness rocks and sending me pictures. Thank you so much. And here's another one that Cinnamon Bear made with a heart on it. And this is his favorite color, salmon. And friends, go ahead and paint those rocks and send them to us. And we'll feature them this week and next week on the show. Oh, my friend Susan Fox is here. Yay, Susan. And Addie, Stella, and MacArthur are here. Wonderful. Thank you, friends, for joining. So speaking of gardens, we're going to do a song today called The Garden Song. Inch by inch, row by row. Tulips, 
And me and Alex say worms, worms, worms. Joe says flowers, aww. And Trisha says eating the harvest, especially the fruits. I love that part of the garden. We have some things in our garden, right? Cinnamon bear that we can eat like tomatoes. And we have some mint and some basil. And Mia saying worms. And Joe is saying food. And Lucy's favorite part is the dirt. <laughs> <laughs> yep, we love that part too. And Grandma says, love seeing the new growth. And Jason says, how is that cute bear moving? What, cinnamon bear? <laughs> Grandma Mitri says, the fresh veggies and the beautiful flowers. <laughs> awesome. Thank you, friends, for sharing all those ideas with us. All right. So we had a request yesterday from a friend her name was Fern, and her mom, Sarah, sent me a link to one of these songs that we sang a long time ago. I think it was actually back in, gosh, 2017, maybe? I think it was three years ago. But we sang a song called Gray Squirrel, and Gray Squirrel wanted to come along and say hello to you. And Gray Squirrel also lives in our garden, and Gray Squirrel has a bushy tail. And Gray Squirrel is holding right this. What is that in his toes? <laughs> An acorn. And right here, what is that? What is that, cinnamon bear? His nose, that's right. And so we'll teach you gray squirrel, and then we have another part to add to this song, and another friend to introduce you to. So can everyone go ahead and make a gray squirrel with your hand, just like that, just like that, cinnamon bear. And then with your other hand, go ahead and make a bushy tail, just like that. Great, let's try it together. Gray squirrel, gray squirrel, swish your bushy tail. Now let's hear it from you at home. Gray squirrel, gray squirrel, swish that bushy tail. Wrinkle up your little nose, catch an acorn in your toes. Gray squirrel, gray squirrel, Swish your bushy tail. Beautiful, friends. And now we have another friend who wants to say hello. It's our bumblebee friend, and our bumblebee also lives in our garden. Bumblebee, bumblebee, flap your golden wings. Bumblebee, bumblebee, Flap your golden wings. Wrinkle up your little nose. Catch a flower in your toes. Bumblebee, bumblebee, flap your golden wings. Psst. Thank you, Bumblebee, for stopping by. Can everyone say goodbye, Bumblebee? Psst. And thank you to Sarah and Fern for recommending that song. That song was sung such a long time ago that I didn't even remember. So thank you for <laughs> helping us to remember. And my friend Arnold is here. Hi, Arnold. All right, let's do a song that we worked on because it was recommended yesterday, but we didn't get time to do it, right, Cinnamon Bear? And this song is called One Day on the Porch. And this song is about being whatever it is that you want to be when you grow up. And so while we do this song, this song was written when my son was a very small boy and he had so many things that he wanted to be when he got bigger. And while we're singing One Day on the Porch, go ahead friends and type in what it is that you would like to be when you grow up. And I'm just gonna tune my ukulele a little bit today because sometimes it goes out of tune when it's a little warm. And Cinnamon Bear, you can tell us after this song what it is that you want to be when you grow up, too. All right, here we go. One day on the porch. Oh, where is it? <laughs> we were just practicing this song earlier today. Here we go. One day on the porch.
And Cinnamon Bear, what is it you want to be when you grow up? Do you remember? Yeah. Oh, he wants to be an astronaut and what? Oh, a carpenter and a chef. Oh, so many things. And a firefighter. Oh my gosh, of course you do. And I see some other friends too. Let's see. Mia Alex says she wants to be a restaurant worker, a doctor, a teacher, a librarian, the first girl major league baseball player, and a bunch of other things, and she hasn't chosen yet. That's wonderful. <laughs> and let's see, Trisha's kids would like to be astronauts, artists, race car driver, and a songwriter. Oh, that's just Simon. That's all just Simon. And Arnold wants to be a farmer, but Trisha says, Arnold, you are a great farmer. <laughs> I love all this. <laughs> And what is this from MacArthur? So many things that he would like to be. Oh my gosh, I don't even know what all those are. And Zoe wants to be a police girl, fire girl, or doctor. Whatever is important, I will do it. Oh, I love that, Zoe. Wonderful. Lucy wants to be a doctor and a bee. Yep, a bee. <laughs> I could see that, Lucy. That's fine. Joe wants to be a Disney Channel actor. And Stella says a singer like Miss Susie. Oh, thank you so much, Stella. Penelope wants to be a gardener. Amazing. And hi from Layla. Hi, Layla. Welcome, welcome. These are wonderful. These are wonderful comments. Thank you so much, friends, for sharing. All right. So speaking of firefighters, we have Cinnamon Bear's fire chief hat here. I know there's so many sit still sit still there's so many other things that you would like to be but at least we have 
our fire chief hats ready to go. And friends at home, go ahead and put on your fire chief helmet if you have it and you can use our imagination just like that. And let's put on our boots and our pants and jacket, zip it up. And what do we wear on our hands? Our gloves. Hi, Mike Messer. My dear friend Mike Messer is watching and he's gonna be on this show very soon next week. Yay! I'm so excited that you're here. And Mike does some wonderful online shows as well. And if you want Mike, you can type in your information for all of our friends. That would be awesome. All right, Cinnamon Bear, what do we use to climb to the tallest tree to rescue a cat? What is that? That's right, a ladder. Go ahead and get your ladders there, ready? And put it on your truck. And last but not least, what do we use to put out the fire? Yes, Cinnamon Bear, <laughs> a hose. So friends, get your hoses ready. Put them on your truck. And all firefighters, when I say go, I want you to drive your fire trucks all around your room, all around your space. And when we say stop, you stop, just like Cinnamon Bear. Here we go. Go. Fire trucks are red. They move fast. They have a ladder that people can climb. Repeat after me. Fire trucks are red. give you a little rest and a little break so everybody let's say goodbye to cinnamon bear cinnamon bear will be back tomorrow let me just help you off a little bit cinnamon bear he's been working so hard helping my husband in the backyard building a deck planting flowers <laughs> so I just wanted to say while Mike Messer is here watching Mike this is for you this is a kindness rock and it says let your light shine Yay! And Mike Messer and I wrote a song together on my third album, and this song is called Let Your Light Shine, and I posted it today on Facebook, and I can't wait for Mike to be my, our special guest next week. And speaking of special guests, tomorrow I'm hosting Elena Moonpark on the show, and I can't wait for you to meet her and to hear her amazing songs and to see her beautiful newest music video called Unhurried Journey. We're going to be showing that during the show. Then on Thursday, I have Julia and Louie the dog joining us. 
I can't wait for them to come back. It's always fun when Julia is on the show. And on Friday, I have my very special guest, Olivia, joining me. Olivia Camp is a wonderful young musician. She'll be singing her own song on Friday. And that's also part of the Summer Friday that Park Hill Parents and Sagir Lewis team at Halstead Realty are presenting. And I'll be hosting that. And it's a fundraiser for Little Essentials. That's all happening on Friday at 4 p.m. And we're, ha- we're going to have puppets from Puppetsburg joining us. That's going to be so exciting. And the last thing that I want to tell you, friends, is that on Saturday we're hosting our first ever house party. And it's a ticketed event. And it's at Saturday at 5 p.m. We're going to be celebrating the first day of summer. And you can find out all that information right here on my website. And because it's a ticketed event, we're going to be able to see each other. It's going to be on Zoom. So I hope that you'll get your tickets and join us for that on Saturday. So friends, thank you so much. Thank you for continuing to support the show. It really means a lot and it helps to keep the show going. You can support the show on PayPal or Venmo. And we'll be here the rest of this month, Monday through Friday at 4 p.m. And one last little thing, if your child's birthday is coming up, we'd love to be invited. Cinnamon Bear and I would love to be a part of the party. And you can just email me at Susie and SusieShelton.com for that information. And look who came to say goodbye, friends. It's Penny. Penny the dog is here. And she wanted to say goodbye to everybody. Aww. <laughs> she's, a, she's a little tired. And she's also, um, also going to have a little bath today. So thank you, friends, for joining. We've had such a fun show today. I can't wait to see you again tomorrow at 4 p.m. Stay connected, friends. Stay positive. We are sending you so much love from our couch in Brooklyn to wherever it is that you're watching. See you tomorrow, friends.